and being a public servant is bigger than any one person. And when it's your time to go, it's your time to go. The race for mayor in Stockton appears to be over, and it is a big upset. I'm sitting down with Mayor Michael Tubbs, who has just conceded the race to his challenger, Kevin Lincoln. That doesn't mean you stop fighting. That means you lick your wounds, you get in the gym a little bit, and you get ready for round two. Well, you mentioned uh, getting in the ring and, and getting back ready for the second round. What does the second round look like for you, sir? Um, some sleep, um, some rest. Um, again, I don't think people understand. I literally spent my entire 20s in the fulcrum of local government. It was election eve 2016, the day that Donald Trump was elected president. Democrat Michael Tubbs Jr. would become the youngest mayor of a major U.S. city and the first black mayor of Stockton. Four years later, he's now conceding the race to a Republican, businessman, and pastor, Kevin Lincoln. Lincoln released this statement saying, I look forward to collaborating with Tubbs on a smooth transition and hope he will continue to enrich our city with his ingenuity and passion for Stockton. Our city is accepted exceptional, and I am proud to have the opportunity to be your mayor. I reached out to Mr. Lincoln to schedule the meeting um, to go over any questions he may have, because being the mayor of Stockton is not an easy job. This was an intentional four-year right-wing misinformation campaign. Um, it, images of me as a crackhead saying I want taxpayer money. Um, this is it, it's four years of that. To prey on the community in, in, in such a way, it's pathetic and it's cowardly and, and it has to stop. To watch more of my conversation with outgoing Mayor Michael Tubbs, head to abc10.com links.